guys, welcome back to Wong Chemistry Channel. For this video, we are going to talk about density. But this is going to be a short video because we will be only discussing one thing, one same thing. We are going to talk about why ice is going to float on water. Have you ever think about this? Why the ice, the solid, okay, will actually float on a water which is a liquid? Because normally, when you have a solid that thrown in a liquid, it will go under the water. Agree? Alright? Your solid will normally sink down into the water. But why this ice, this solid, will actually float on the water rather than sink down or going under the water? Why the ice solid is not actually sinking into the water? Have you ever thought about this? This is all because of one thing. The arrangement of the solid water. When your water turns into ice from the liquid changing to your solid, when your liquid changing to solid, the arrangement change. In the solid water or in the ice, one water molecule, your H2O over here, will be tetrahedrally bonded. It will be tetrahedrally bonded to another four water molecule. Can you see that? So one water molecule will be tetrahedrally bonded to another four water molecule and creating this space, all right? And in this space, there will be one thing. Imagine a 3D. You will form a lot of empty spaces. And this is only about one water molecule bonded tetrahedrally to another four water molecule. What happened in a ice? when you have a lot of water molecule. This is the 3D structure of the ice. You can see over here, one water molecule is still tetrahedrally bonded to another four water molecule, okay? And when they are tetrahedrally bonded, they're creating all these empty spaces. Can you see all these empty spaces? And all these empty spaces will cause the density of the ice lower than the liquid, all right? Because this empty spaces is only having air, having nothing. So the density will become lower, okay? This is the reason why the solid water, your eyes, will actually float on water, okay? Even though your water is a liquid. Because the arrangement of water in solid will give rise to a lot of all these empty spaces. All right, and all these empty spaces will then cause the density of the ice lower than the liquid. This is the reason why your ice will float on a water. Okay, and the complete explanation of why the ice will float on water is because your solid water, ice, is less dense than the liquid water. In the ice, each of the water molecule, like I show you, each of the water molecule will be tetrahedrally bonded to another four water molecule. And in this arrangement, it will give rise to what? In this arrangement, it will give rise to an open structure with a large empty spaces between them. And this large empty space is the one that will cause the ice having a lower density than the liquid water. And that's why your ice will float on water and it's only as simple as that okay that is the reason why the ice will float on the water easy only these four points is enough to explain why the ice will float on water and i hope this short video able to explain to you why the ice float on water i hope you understand it very clearly right now it's, it's only these four sentences if you still have any question, drop it in the comment below and make sure you like the video and subscribe to my channel. I will see you again in the next video and thank you for watching.